Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Syntax, and today I'm going to be showing you what it's like to work as a developer in the Vision Pro. Now, I'm going to warn you that sometimes when I'm doing this, it can get a little bit shaky because of just how the video records on this thing. In my view, it doesn't look shaky at all, but I'm talking, I'm moving, I'm a wiggly guy. It happens. So I'll try to apply some sort of post-processing to this. I'm going to try not to move around too much just so you get a clearer picture. Now, this in front of me is my computer screen. You can see it's a much larger aspect ratio. It's a much larger screen, and it's positioned directly on top of here. When I sit down on my desk, it just a little button pops up that says connect to screen. I click it. This window pops up. Now, this window, people have expressed that they're bummed out that you can't have multiple of these windows open, like you can't have multiple displays. But let me show you why that doesn't necessarily matter. I have my calendar over here. I have my photo frame with my daughter, my podcast. I have Discord. I have all of this up here, and it's offloading the types of things I would normally do on my computer to another space. Now, what's amazing is that if I just glance over here, I can use my mouse and keyboard, hello, without having to really do anything. And I look at this screen and check it out. My mouse automatically went back here. Now again, these, like my calendar app, these are Vision Pro apps. And my keyboard and mouse just goes right to them. Now as far as development goes, I think this thing is really super good. So uh, you can see this is my code environment here. I'm working on this fun HTMX site. And what's neat about this is that the text quality, especially compared to other headsets, is so stinking clear. It might look blurry because of the way that the rendering works. It tracks your eyes and renders that stuff very cleanly. So when I'm looking at this, everything that I'm looking at is extremely clear, as clear as my laptop. And I don't get a ton of issues with that. So as somebody who has worn a lot of headsets, I don't really get any eye fatigue reading on this. That wasn't necessarily the case with the other headsets. I could only use them for an hour at a time if they were on my computer. I'm not getting any fatigue. I could use this all day, and I have. Um, so that's really neat. Also, the weight. People were talking about the weight. I haven't had any issues with that. It could just be because I spin on my head but the weight itself has not been a problem to me. It feels the same as most other headsets. I would imagine if you, you've been used to wearing a Quest or Quest through two or three, you're not going to feel that much difference there. To me, it's been a non-issue. Um, so all those things in mind, I've been using this as my monitor, and I've been doing so for a couple days now, and I, I'm probably... <laughs> I'm probably not going to not use this for a long time. I found it to be really super good. So that's just my thoughts and opinions as a developer web dev working on this thing and giving it a try. Now, if you have any questions about this, drop them below. I will do my best to demo or answer anything that you could possibly have as a web developer for this headset. And also, if you just want to make fun of me for how goofy it looks, go ahead too. That's cool. All fair game. Well, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.